<laughs> it's three to two. We have potentially two more games. Um, and the next one is gonna be a ZVT. Oh, we probably don't. It's gonna be Siki. Siki is gonna be playing against Bender, uh, who I have seen before, but I don't really know too much about this guy. Um, but yeah, that's, that's gonna be a little bit difficult. Gonna be a little bit hard to beat Mr. Siki. But you know, it has been done in the past, not many times, and usually it was done by Koreans, but it has been done. So here we go. Game number six of this Gambit's Cup match between Sass and IWL. Sass one game away from victory. At the left side, as the Blue Zerg, we have the ace player of Sass, Sass Siki. Coming out on Tau Cross. At the top right as the Orange Terran. The heroic Terran who needs to save his team from defeat. It is going to be IWL Bender. Now Tau Cross is an interesting map actually. Uh, pretty old school map. It, 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 wasn't this used in like WCG 2005 or something? This is a super old map, but it is pretty fun nonetheless. Uh, and uh, I think it actually lends itself well to mech playing TBZ. So uh, we'll see if we can get any, anything like that going. But, uh, damn. Now, people are asking me if I'm going to cast anything else. I was thinking about it before. I was thinking to myself, I was like, all right. If, the, if this clan war isn't overly epic, then I'll probably cast another one. But if it, like, goes to ace match, then I probably won't. So, yeah, I'm, I'm still sticking by that. Like, <clears throat> if we get two more games that are half an hour each, I don't think I'll cast another one. I won't cast another series. Um, but we'll see. <clears throat> anyway. Man, that one game, I think, well, that was enough for a whole clown war. Damn, what a good game. Anyway, uh, looks like a, oh, an 8 racks in the base from Mr. Bender. Curious. Normally, I mean, I don't know why he wouldn't at least put that at his natural to get, you know, slightly closer to the other player, but it's all good, it's all good. SCV gonna barely miss that Overlord. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, so, uh, so we're just gonna have some 12 patch in action from Mr. Siki. Our TLS, uh, TLS semi-finalist. And I don't see anything too interesting here from Bender. Doesn't seem that he's gonna do anything too crazy with his 8 racks. That wasn't 8 racks, right? I'm not just, I'm not just an idiot. Am I an idiot? Can somebody confirm that this was an Arax and I'm not like completely insane? I mean, given how crazy last game was, I wouldn't be surprised if I just can't see straight anymore. Uh, but it looks like we're gonna have some two hatch in action here from Siki. Uh, which is slightly curious to me, I don't think this is a particularly good map for that kind of thing. He's also got like seven drones now because of it. Oh my god. Doing the double drone- I was like, why does he have no drones? It's because he's doing a double drone block here, so he doesn't get a supply depot here. If a supply depot goes down here, uh, it's drone- I think it's drone type, but not link type. It might even be link type, I'm not really sure. Ah, oh, taking it down. So doing the good old defense of the eight racks. Ziki, see, Ziki only needs three drones. Like, some players, they pull five drones. If you're Eon's you pull every single drone. But Ziki- okay, he needs four drones now. He's like, you know what, I'll make a compromise. I'll go for four, uh, but he's gonna be completely fine. So the Arax does nothing, and Bender will uh, just chill. I mean, he's just gonna follow up with an expansion anyway, so it's fine. And gonna poke around. He's gonna see the link coming out. He's gonna see the gas with no third hatch, so he, he knows kind of what's going on here. And uh, what was I saying earlier? Oh, yeah, I was saying how this is not a good map for twelve hatch, or sorry for. Two hatch muta. I mean, the natural is kind of harassable, but you can put turrets behind. Um, so it's not, I mean, you can defend it. And like, the main is not harassable at all. There's like so much space here. It's hugging the edge of the map. Um, it's like, no, I don't think this is a particularly great map for two hatch muta. But I mean, I, I'm, if, when you're Seeky, it's like every map is a good map for every strategy. So I, I don't think it's relevant. Anyway. Oh god! Oh god! Oh shit! What's going on? What's happening? Is he gonna lose to four Zerglings? Oh my god, Bender. Bender, what are you doing? What are you doing? What's going on? He's gonna win with four Zerglings. I mean, I know Seekylings are imbalanced, but this is just a little bit ridiculous. I mean, what the hell? <laughs> 
What the shit? He's gonna win with four Zerglings. Oh man, Seeky. Seeky, that's not fair, man. Oh, dude. Forella? That's, that's totally Bender's fault, though. I don't know what those Marines were doing. But Seeky just killed like three Marines and an SEV and didn't even lose a single Zergling. I don't know how that happened. He almost got another one right there. Dang. Dang, son. And where are the Mutas, actually? Okay, looks like they're, they're, they're a little bit ways off. So, uh, Bender's alright. And Seeky's actually making more links. I'm not convinced about this. Um, Bender's actually got a pretty decent setup. And by that, I mean, oh my god, the SEVs need to come back. Is speed done yet? I think speed is done. Oh shit. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh Seaball! Well that was anticlimactic. Uh right. <laughs> IWL Bender has left the building. Uh, I guess Sass wins. Sass victorious! <laughs> oh, poor Bender, man. Poor Bender. I don't know what he was doing there. Like, someone, like what was that A-Rax? In the main A-Rax? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, Seeky Lings, what are you gonna do? So, Sass takes it down. Four to two. And uh, I think that's gonna be it for me. For today, it's been a couple hours, it's been a good cast, it's been a good match, it's been a good match. So uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, I will do two matches next weekend though, because it is Easter weekend, so I get a four day weekend, it's going to be awesome. So I'll do uh, I'll do at least two matches next weekend. I may even do all four, just like on different days, I don't know, we'll see.